traditional computer programs have a fixed logic. Uh, machine learning is kind of opening a bit a new door to make this a bit more soft, uh, more versatile to answer questions. Maybe the most systematic way to do it is it's actually a topic which is accessible to a broad range of backgrounds. So it's not necessary that students already need to have a bachelor in computer science to be able to follow that, to make it accessible to everyone in all the, the master programs. When our students do the projects, they work a lot with online materials. Uh, we encourage them to use everything which is available. The students in groups of three go to such a lab and do an interdisciplinary project. And they do this very, very hands-on to get practical experience. It can, can be a fun new application, like a new data set or trying to predict uh, something new or try a novel approach. Because we do these practical projects, the students really combine the, the research aspect and the learning aspect, so I think that's, that's something that I like when, when we can mix the two things of teaching and research. I really like when, when you can see that the students are, are truly interested in learning that topic and if you can see that they, they understood some part of, of the concept of teaching and they're happy about it, then that's really rewarding. As long as the students are as motivated as they they are now, it's a huge pleasure to work with them and to let them use their skill and let them build uh, real things.